firmly believe in uh, democracy, democratic system, because in a perfect decentralized democracy, we can be able to hear the voice of the last man of the society. It is the beauty of the democracy. And uh, in a democracy, there are so many approaches. A decentralized democracy, people's democracy, and open democracy. Uh, many, many, many more people, they will argue, of course, uh, democracy, but uh, there is a closed democracy. But I believe in the open democracy, a social democracy. So, democracy will ultimately, it will uh, save this nation if you keep it open and uh, uh, debatable. Uh, then, democracy is the only way to uh, face this uh, present problem. India is a such a complex society. Uh, there is a caste, there is a religion, there is a class, rich and poor. So the uh, school like uh, democratic uh, school of thoughts. Uh, we are forming a, a Indian school of uh, socialism. Very recently, we are going to form an Indian school of socialism. So uh, that's why uh, democracy is the main uh, I mean, uh, focus point of the growth uh, and development of the society. In, in those days, when I started my politics, values are very high. Now, now it has become a pyramid now. The values have become totally down and uh, the upper side is totally So, if you want to bring the changes, these values, we have to rebuild this society. So we have to rethink about the uh, system of the society and uh, democracy and uh, secularism. So, ultimately, we have to change the values. Well, it's only survival. Of course, many good things we could uh, able to bring in this country, like uh, bank nationalization, the NRGS, and uh, many more things uh, we have brought uh, changes. But uh, still, poverty is still existing, gas system still is there and uh, rich and poor gap is growing day by day like anything. This is a dangerous democracy. This gap is growing between the poor and rich, then the democracy is a dangerous.